Hey everyone and welcome to another video. Today we will be talking about KB Lake which is Intel 7 Gen CPU lineup and is built on the same 14 nanometer architecture as Skylake. According to Intel, KB Lake is an optimized version of the existing Skylake architecture so you shouldn't expect any kind of significant gains. KB Lake also introduces new motherboard chipsets such as the Z270, H270 etc. But we'll talk about that in a separate video. For now our main question is going to be that is KB Lake worth upgrading to? Is it worth your money? And how does it compare to older gen Intel CPUs? I have created some charts sticking Intel's current mainstream processors such as Pentium, i3, i5 and i7 and compared them with their respective generations from Sandy Bridge that is 2nd gen till KB Lake. So let's have a look at them first and then we'll talk about that. After looking at those charts, we can easily tell how far has Intel come since Sandy Bridge. I mean yes there are some improvements since Sandy Bridge but they are not that realistic that you should spend extra money on KB Lake. So according to me, if you are planning to upgrade to KB Lake, I don't think it's the right time just yet. The only KB Lake CPU I can recommend upgrading to is the Pentium G4560. Well if you own anything worse than that. Also, I would recommend waiting for AMD's Ryzen CPUs and see what they have to offer against Intel. Well, thank you so much for watching. I hope you liked the video. Please like if you liked it, share, comment and subscribe. Peace.